Jello Wom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise on the glory to <clears throat> Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahushai, Bahashem, the Prophet of God, double arms to the apostles, elders, the great millstone, a salutation of brothers who's pushing this word in truth and sincer with sincerity and with charity and risking their lives in freedom of submission. This is Brad Yana Guy, coming from the Great Millstone Chicago camp, coming at you with another lesson on what's edifying. It's gonna be a scripture of the day, you know. Um, basically, I was just meditating and um, I was <laughs> basically thinking, Jake, Jake say they do, but they really don't. All right, and um, what I mean by that, <clears throat> I'm, I'm uh, bring up the scripture in the book of Isaiah. You know, um, a Jake is just full of shit, man. All right, and um, the main thing that Jake don't or Jake run away from is accountability. All right, they rather hear bullshit. They don't want to hear the things that they're doing wrong to, in order to get right. All right, they rather hear um the things that satisfy the flesh. All right. So, with that being said, I want you to uh, get the scripture in Isaiah chapter 30, verse 9. It says that this is a rebellious people, lying children, children that will not hear the law of the Lord, which say to the seers, see not, and to the prophets, prophesy, unto, prophesy not unto us right things, speak unto us smooth things, prophesy deceit. All right, <clears throat> and that's exactly what it is, man. These people want to hear total BS. They want to hear <laughs> that the Lord is for everybody. They want to hear that the Lord is not coming to destroy this place. All right, that you don't have to uh, repent. All right, you can live it up. All right, you can fulfill the lust of the flesh. All right, that's what these people want to hear. And that's what basically what they teach you in these churches because love is an action. They say they love the Lord, all right, but they don't, all right. <laughs> There's another scripture that also says, um, with their lips they do honor me, you know, but their heart is far from me, all right. Roughly paraphrasing. And <clears throat> they say they love the Lord. You know. But the actions prove otherwise. Alright. They're committing adultery. They're eating pork. And they, they, they're worshipping these, these, these false gods. These idols. They're celebrating these wicked holidays. Alright. They're doing everything that's contrary to the scriptures. That's contrary to the Lord. So they really truly don't love the Lord. They love themselves. They rather really hear all the other bullshit. They don't want to hear prophecy. All right. Hey, because <clears throat> what does scripture say? The testimony of y'all shy is the spirit, is the spirit of prophecy. All right. Roughly paraphrasing. All right. And if you're meditating the law thereof, you'll be occupied in prophecies. <laughs> All right, so these people ain't with it. These people don't. They then then you tell them about the MOTD. It doesn't matter. They're gonna get it. You know, tell them about World War Three. They see it. They don't care. All right, these people are just through. All right, the rebellious people, rebellious children. All right. And the Lord ain't dealing with them, man. That's why they will be destroyed. Two thirds of our people will be destroyed. So they say they do, but they really don't. So the one that, <clears throat> that was edifying scripture of the day. Until next time, call Halom, Laihau, Bachimiao, Shai. Till next time, Ababa, Ababa.